Yo, I'm about to close combat at level 100 Blissey on Diamond and Pearl. Yo, that's a good way to pass time during quarantine. I found an old PC monitor, so I decorated it a little. What website is that? <sighs> the only good one. Yeah, just some totally normal pictures of Waluigi and Wario. Okay, so literally no one has guessed all the things I changed this pic, surprisingly. So, their pink noses are now flesh-toned, their blue eye bags have been removed, and their pupils have been doubled to a more normal size. Wow, so all they need is more sleep in their vine. Name two more relatable characters. Why does well-rested Wario look like me? Beetles compromise 25% of all animal species. That means one in four animals is probably a beetle. Is it you? Is it your best friend? How could you be sure? You know, Ringo could be living in your backyard without you even knowing. I don't think anyone would be surprised if they found Ringo just hanging out in the garden. Both of you to assume he wouldn't be hanging out in an octopus's garden. Uppercase and lowercase cats. Oh my god. My German Shepherd is crazy. Every once in a while I catch him doing this. What, what, what is he doing? He's becoming self-aware. Why must I be like that? Why must I chase the cat? Hashtag team, we have no idea where the fuck we are. They look like the choose your character menu in a video game or something. Except Dean's facing the wrong way? Well that's because Dean hasn't been unlocked yet. All I wanna do is see you turn into a giant bagel, a giant bagel. All I wanna be is someone who gets to see a giant bagel. And now an important PSA about when your car is smoking. Like, literally smoking from the engine. Why don't you smell pancakes? It's the coolant. Panic and pull over, but you'll live. A slight blue tinge? It's the oil. Panic and pull over, but you'll live. Gray looks like fire smoke? Gasoline, the most combustible and dangerous. Pull over and leave the vehicle and pray. Sharing because I didn't know this when my car started smoking white yesterday and I was so afraid for my life. Reblogging because a dear friend of my mom with mechanic experience told me the same thing when I got my license. Save a life! Now, video games have made me violent, but they have made me feel like I'm supposed to pick this up. I really like stickers, but at the same time, I don't because you stick them somewhere and that's it. It's finished. I'm just uh, emotionally stable enough for that responsibility. I've been waiting for this post my whole life. I was trying to explain this to someone one day and they basically told me I was crazy. My pronoun of choice is they. But you're one person. Nah, <laughs> look at this person who doesn't know that MB people are just a swarm of bees in disguise. Release the non bee diaries. And look, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Why do you think one of the terms is NB? I am a simple woman. I hear the Pirates of the Caribbean music. I become gripped with the urge to don pirate garb and fight cursed skeletons upon the open sea. Mood. Today, my girlfriend said, you know, when Donkey asked Shrek what his name is, Shrek pauses before he says Shrek, and I'm convinced he just came up with it on the spot. We weren't even talking about Shrek. I can't stop thinking about it, or how lucky I am to be with her. Also, that's a good point! I know what you are. You're impossibly fast and strong. Your skin is pale white and ice cold. Your eyes change color and you never eat or come out into the sun. Say it. Frosty the Snowman. This guy did the coolest but most probably illegal DIY project ever. The end result, genius. He made LaCroix? Nah, that's too much flavor for LaCroix. Um, it's pronounced LaCroix? It's pronounced... <laughs> However you want to fucking say it, because the name's stupid. Hey, yo, that Blissey. She dead yet? <sighs> no. Today I learned that the Arctic Shrew is so territorial if that two are placed together, one will drop dead within a few days, even without physical injuries. My god. A five-day telepathic battle. When my parrot want pets off someone, he'll go up to them, say, Hello, and lower his head to expose his neck. Recently, however... He's been doing this to a pitch black crevice behind the couch. Even trying to call the darkness with kissy noises and getting sad when the void won't pet him. How do I explain that dark chasms are not his friend? There's a ghost in there. A damn rude one too! Pet the bird!